Okay, Fight Fans, MMA fanatics and lovers of the sport, this is CombatSportsTVLive.com. We're coming to you live in our world one more time. We're down here at the beautiful gym of Motors Gym. Look over to my left, your right, you see none other than Elisar Rodriguez. Elisar, how you doing, brother? I know, good. Oh, he always talks slow. You know what? I've got to drag those words out of him. But Elisar, you know what? We're getting ready right now for an XKO. 13 fight it's going to be december the third that you just told me about are you tell me what you've done right now what's the camp been like uh the camp's been pretty good you know i've been working uh my takedowns ground stand up just uh just trying to stay well rounded well i gotta tell you right now ladies and gentlemen this man right here does a lot of heavy talking in the cage itself let me go and give you a little bit of information right here he's climbing into the cage with a guy by the name of homer garcia as an amateur, I'm going to tell you right now, he knows no defeat, 4-0. Now he's just encroaching himself upon the pro ranks of MMA. Elisada, tell me right now, what can we expect? The fight fans out here, if we go out to XKO 13, on December the 3rd, what can we expect to see from you? Uh, you can expect a high-intensity fight. You know, it's going to be exciting. You know, it's going to be a lot of... Uh... <laughs> That's gonna be a lot of fun. Reyes Jiu Jitsu is who this man is fighting out of, out of Irving, Texas. I think you guys are over there on MacArthur, right? Uh, yes, yes. But I mean, today, you know, I got to tell you right now, they do a lot of cross training. They get the best out of each other by crossing over, and that's what makes MMA such a beautiful sport. Scholars and gentlemen outside the ring and covetous gladiators inside. I've got to tell you one more thing before we start looking at this. LSI, I know that you've made a tremendous transition from an amateur to a pro. Tell me what's the biggest change you have had to experience as a pro coming out of the amateur ranks? Uh, I don't know. I think I just, I guess I just have to take it more seriously, you know. Uh, I have to work harder, you know, I have to kind of try to maintain myself sure. better, you know. Uh, it's just, you know, think about it a lot more, you know. It's kind of becoming you. more of a way of life. Oh, you're that come, come, it becomes a way of life. You know, the one thing I can always say, Elisada, when I've seen you in the cage, it's always been excitement, it's always been action-packed, it's always been the action, it's always been bell to bell, Elisada Rodriguez. What, what sparks that inside you to bring that type of action? Uh, I'm, you know, I'm not sure exactly. You know, it's, just, it's just who I am. You know, <laughs> you know what I think? I think it's a love for the sport. I've got a feeling it really is a love for the sport. Elisada, any final words you want to say as we prepare for this, you know, Homer Garcia? Any last words you want to tell Homer if he's over here watching? I uh, just prepare for war. <laughs> Homer, I know you, baby, and I know you bring the action, but I got a feeling I'm going to love this. To the fight fans of MMA, I've got to tell you right now, you want to see a good fight, you want to see some good action, you better be there. XKO 13, that's going to be December the 3rd. It's going to be in Arlington, Texas, the gym itself, over on Mayfield Drive. Any last minute shout outs? Uh, just, I'd like to say, give a shout out to Knockout Syndrome, uh, Motor Jiu Jitsu, Team Reyes Jiu Jitsu, uh, F3, you know, all my training partners. Well, I've got to sit here and ask the cameraman, Mr. Uh, Pete himself. We thank you for being here, Pete. But take a picture of this shirt right here. Knockout syndrome itself right here. This is what you call the fight leader of apparel wear here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. We've got to give a quick shout out right now to Rafael Perez and also Dustin. We thank you guys for bringing us the action from the standpoint of supporting these guys. On behalf of CS Combat Sports TV Live.com, it's been a joyful interview right here. We wish you the best of luck, Elisar, as he gets ready for his next fight. This is Roland Gomez, the voice of combative sports in the state of Texas. Until our next meeting.